Hi Rochelle, my name is Dustin. We just got off the phone and I told you that I'd get you a video of the X-T4 and the Buick Envision. So here we are. So we'll start with the X-T4 and this is about perfect for what you're looking for. It's white, it's all wheel drive and it has the sunroof in it. And we'll do the outside first so you can get, an, uh, get a gauge on exterior sizing. Personally, the, the, the more compact, because I wouldn't call this compact, but the more compact SUVs are more of my favorites. And if I flip this around, I am six foot one. So at six one, the roof line of the vehicle comes to here, if you can kind of see the gauge on that, to give you an idea. So I don't know how, I mean, a lot of people say I've got a big head. So I would say that um, if I'm six one, coming down to the height, you're probably looking at a uh, five nine, five ten to the top top of the car. So at 6'1", we'll jump in the vehicle here and I will turn the radio down here. So if I spin this around, 6'1", and my seat is definitely uh, definitely elevated here, if I can get it turned down for us. And if I were comfortably driving, I would say that I would be somewhere around mm, about right here or so. So if you can see me my my head if you can see and i can't see because the camera's facing away but i have plenty of plenty of room here so um unless you are six foot five um i don't think you're gonna have much of an issue with that um interior sizing here pretty spacious left to right in my opinion i think that there's a lot of uh, leg room here uh, the front seat is moved this passenger front seat's moved pretty much all the way up which is why this gap looks so small but even when sitting there with the, with the seat all the way up. Pretty decent room. Back seats. And then of course, do the little, even though there's some snow up there, I'll show you the whole panoramic roof here. So the sunroof in the front, moonroof in the back. And when that snow's not up there, it really opens up the car, gives you a lot of light, makes, feel, makes the vehicle feel much uh, larger. Okay, so let's jump out of this, and I'm trying to keep the video as short as possible, which is not really a thing when you're going over two vehicles, but that's okay. And we'll move on to the Buick Envision. So here's the Envision. So as you can see, and here I actually have a, a blue X-T5 side by side. So I'll give you a little bit of a gauge on that. There's your X-T5. There's your Envision. Almost identical in size. I would say the, the Envision might be... Um, about an, less than an inch shorter in total roof height. Interior, pretty spacious as well. They do an awesome job. Let's turn the heat down. I don't want you to hear that. They do an awesome job at keeping size um, open in these, in these smaller SUVs. So uh, back to leg room down here, if you can see, still open, still plenty of room. Um, as for headspace, I don't know, must be short people driving all these cars. As for headspace, I'll flip it back around. You can see plenty of plenty of room from head to ceiling. For me, it's six one. So, once again, unless you're um, six foot five, I don't think you'll have much of an issue with that. Here you can see the space up front. Now this seat's probably moved all the way back, opposite from the XT4 earlier. But even with the seat all the way back, you can see the back seat still has plenty of room for your for your average rider. And then this one isn't quite as tailored to you with all-wheel drive, white sunroof, things like that. But, like I said, as long as you get the, the judge for size, then I think we, we have mission accomplished. So, give you one more look of them side by side here. And you can tell, very, very similar. So, I hope that this has answered your questions on sizing and also made me look embarrassingly dumb in all of these videos like I said that I do. Um, and if you have any questions, give us a call, 330-482-3331, or you can call or text my cell phone, which is 330-718-1107. Talk to you soon, Michelle.